In the commercial diving industry, mistakes can often have dire or even fatal consequences. Some of the easiest mistakes to avoid are equipment malfunctions. With regular maintenance, commercial dive helmets should continue to function safely for years. But without regular inspection and maintenance, divers risk a malfunction that could put their safety at risk. The importance of the maintenance, this is, for one thing, this is life support equipment. Okay, that one of the big misconceptions out there, people don't take care of this stuff. They don't realize that this is the only thing keeping you alive underwater. It's not like a car where a car breaks down, you pull over to the side of the road, call a tow truck. If this thing fails underwater, it could cost you your life. So the maintenance is extremely important on this stuff to make sure that it is maintained and adjusted in accordance with the way the manufacturer recommends. Helmet manufacturer Kirby Morgan recommends performing inspections daily, monthly, and annually as it provides a much more accurate picture of the equipment's maintenance needs than simply logging its hours of use. We've seen helmets come into our shop that are 10 years old that have never been serviced. We're servicing the hat for the first time. And it's amazing because the helmet does work. It's still working, but not the way it's supposed to work. But they just get used to using it that way. And they go, oh, that's an old 17, they always do that. That's not the way it works. Keep in mind, regardless of the manufacturer, all helmets and masks must be maintained, inspected, and tested in accordance with the manufacturer's recommendations. The International Consensus Standards for Commercial Diving and Underwater Operations outlines the guidelines for acceptable equipment maintenance. These guidelines are available for all diving professionals on the ADCI website at adc-int.org. We actually have on the Kirby Morgan website, the Dive Lab website, there are daily inspections, monthly inspections, annual overhauls. Kirby Morgan has always had this. From day one, they have always had maintenance schedules and periodicity for the helmets. People just choose not to do it. While any diver can and should regularly inspect their equipment, Kirby Morgan also recommends that only certified technicians should make equipment repairs. Making repairs without the proper training puts any diver using the equipment at risk for malfunctions. In conclusion, it's very easy to keep your helmet safe and in perfect working condition. All you have to do is follow the clearly outlined manufacturer's recommendations. If you follow the manufacturer's recommendations, you're not going to have any problems with these helmets. And they will literally last for generations. I mean, there are helmets out there, and I use the military as an example. Their helmets are 30 and 40 years old and still in pristine condition. Commercial diving helmets are built to withstand punishing underwater conditions for decades. Regular inspection and maintenance are a critical part of keeping them working safely and effectively for the divers that rely on them. For more information on ADCI's resources, click subscribe and never miss an episode.